Here it is guys, the finished product, the GT Omega Evo XL in blue. It looks freaking sweet. So mainly there's only gonna be one chair behind the desk, but if I need to have someone co-host live in person with me, I can do that. We could have matching chairs and be super comfortable. But if not, uh, the other chair will be over here where the editing slash producer bay will be. So this section right now is super messy, but that's gonna be solved once I finish the insulation over here and around the rest of the shed, uh, we are gonna put more paneling, which is gonna be great. So it's gonna go all along this wall. And then I'm gonna put up the Ikea desk that I got and I'm going to put up a triple monitor stand and it's gonna be super nice. And that's where the other chair is gonna sit. Stay tuned for the next Pimp My Shed where I'll be talking about this stuff in detail. So I wanna give a shout out to GT Omega for hooking me up with both of these chairs. I am super happy with how they turned out. So one of the things that really jumps out to people right away is how badass this thing looks and that's one of the things that people really enjoy about racing slash gaming chairs is the way they look they're just gonna be an awesome accessory for your setup and they just look comfortable and they really are one of my favorite pieces has to not only be the headrest which I love and I use a lot on my chair but I love the lumbar support because you'd be surprised I'll be honest when I first looked at it, I was like that's not really gonna be comfortable when I sat down it was like perfect and I like how you could very easily move it to what part of the chair you want which is great the quality is great I like the wheels which surprisingly that's that's a big deal um, on my other chair they sent me premium wheels and those were not so premium they were like rollerblade ones and then uh, their actual wheels don't really compare to GT Omega because these just feel nicer they have a little bit more weight to it which I like so my other chair if you go like this the piece actually moves back and forth. But what I like about GT Omega is it actually stays in lock, which is a very big deal to me because the other one gets very aggravating. So that's good. I like that it has all the other functionalities, move it back, move it forward, move it sideways. So the armrest is really nice. The quality is really good. So this is pretty common with most chairs. One side will stop you from leaning back. Uh, the other side will help you go up and down. And then this bar right here is pretty crazy because it will completely recline back this piece so you can lay on it like a flat bed which is just insane and I tried it over here and it worked just like how it's supposed to but I don't have a lot of room currently due to this mess so I'm not gonna actually demonstrate that but I can tell you that uh, it, it is frightening, but it does work. So GT Omega does offer a few different designs, but I chose the Evo XL because I feel like it's simple, but it's not. It's just enough to make it stand out without being too crazy of a chair. Uh, of course, they have different colors. They have all the different options which you can check out at gtomegaracing.com. I'm gonna leave all the links below. I'm also super excited because GT Omega hooked me up with a 5% off coupon, and that promo code is Flamingo. So if you wanna pick up one of your own GT Omega, Again, the link is down below. Promo code Flamingo is going to get you 5% off your purchase. I will be doing an update on this once I use it a little bit more just to let you know how it holds up. But these are the new seats for the uh, shed and I'm freaking hyped. So just a quick video to let you know what's happening in the shed. That uh, the new chairs are here which are great. And there is a new pin my shed coming soon with an update for all the things happening on that side. Which... God help me, please. Thanks so much for watching, guys. And if you got this far into the video, go ahead and write GT Omega Flamingo. Don't forget, I'm Matt Philly and you're not. Get out of my face. Have a great day. And I'll catch you on the flippity flop. Boom.